we are starting a Let's Play of The Sims 4 High School Years. We have Ray Raccoon, we have an exchange student, and we have two dads? Oh well, let's get started. I want you to meet the Raccoon family. We have Vincent and Preston who fell in love and adopted Ray. Though having two dads sometimes is a bonus, doesn't make life as a teenager any easier. So Ray has decided that she wants to be more on the alternative side. She shows an aspiration of Drama Llama, and she's okay with that life. And since Vincent and Preston have a three bedroom house, what better way to fill that third bedroom with an exchange student? Everyone meet Raja Mattel. He's not from here, but he's trying to give life as a teenager in Copperdale his best try. He has an aspiration of live fast and that's what he likes to do. So like I said, they live in this lovely three bedroom house. It has a nice side yard with a pool. What more could a teen ask for? Since it's Monday in the game, we'll be starting on Tuesday because everyone hates Mondays. It is Tuesday morning. We are getting ready for school. Ray is hungry as ever. Oh, Preston's got a beard already. Do you make food? Oh, I have Vincent making food. Okay, Preston, I want you to shave your facial hair, please. Nice. Freshly shaven. Got chest hair, too. Oh, my gosh. All right, let's call the household to the meal. School starts in like a half an hour. Wait, why are you embarrassed? You cannot unsee. You walked in on him. Ugh, great. You're both embarrassed? Oh my gosh. You guys are supposed to be eating food. What are we doing? All right, well, I guess we're going to school hungry. Like what students to follow? I want to follow both Ray and Raja, so here we go. Copperdale High. Both of my kids are starving. Ah, oh, vending machine. Oh, come on, Ray. Go purchase a snack. I know you're hungry. Raja's just going to order food because he's not from here. I did set up social bunny for both of them, though they don't really know many people. It looks like Roger's getting DMs from himself, which I don't understand. All right, let's see how Ray's doing. Oh, come on. Do I dare shake it? Oh, come on. First day as a teenager. We get our food. Uh, right. I don't want to die on my first day of school, so just order food. Can I get a tortilla wrap to hot dog? Why am I being rude to Raja? I said, please just go back into your house and remove the door. No one wants to see you in public. Come on, Ray. He's he's not from here. Give the guy a break. All right. How about we claim a locker? That's something you have to do in high school. You have to find a place to put all your stuff. I guess we can do some of our wants. Oh no. Class is in half an hour. Well, let me claim this locker real quick and then I'll get to class. All right, Ray. X nay on the hot dog, eh? Let's go to class. Right on time. All right, so we're in social studies class. We got Emery. That's Cassandra Goth. Everyone knows Cassandra. Sydney Price. Oh, and Ash is in our class too. Ash is part of the chess team? Hey, I thought you were on the football team, Sydney. Wow. Is there something going on I don't know about? Nope. Nothing's going on. We have exams on Friday, though. So, and prom on Saturday. We gotta start making friends. I'm just, like, so pissed. What do I want to do? Chat with other students. Gossip with other sims. I'm gonna freshen up in the mirror. Okay. Right after class, Ray. We're gonna get all that stuff taken care of. Yeah, class is over. Lunch begins. And we already ate before school, so let's, uh, talk it up. All right, Ray. I need you to go freshen up because that's what you want to do. Then we're going to claim a locker. <gasps> Hit it angrily. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to angrily hit this locker. I mean, Roger's making all kinds of friends. No, I want you... To... Now I can't hit it? All right, claim a locker. Oh. Let's decorate our locker. Boss decorations, please. Flirting with Molly? You flirting with Molly. Yeah. Talking about trash. Actually. Can I gossip with her? Let's gossip with Molly. Alright, well, Ray's gossiping. See how Raj is doing. I think he's doing great. He wants to go for a jog. He wants to enjoy rides at the pier. He wants to chat with other students. 
I mean, there's no one down here, so I guess that's fun. How's my drama llama going? I think we're hitting on Molly. She's flirty. We're flirty. Let's make this happen. Oh, come on. School's... Oh, no, no, no. The bell just rang. Molly, no! Keep talking to me. Keep talking to me. Molly, no, no, no. <sighs> I like real life. She wants to be friendly with Molly. All right, we can do that. Can we add her on Social Bunny? Ooh, she wants to add us. Let's tag Molly in a message. Flirty. Passing Steamy looks across the room anytime I see Molly. I need to get my flirt on. Let's send a new message to Molly. We're going to slip into her DMs. A little flirty message. Where's Raja? Yeah. Let's see who he wants to add. We got some social bunny stuff going on here. And um, I guess we don't know anyone else. Can we post about something? About orientation. Energized narrative. Why is Ray in the back? And why is Raj in the front? Oh my god. And every child is on their phone. Sorry. Teenager. Okay, so as Lip Bass, as the Lip Bass aspiration, he wants to pull three pranks, get in trouble, and sneak out to a party. So, with that being said, we need to pull some pranks. Oh, well... Ray and Raja both did great today. How about the whiteboard? Can I prank the whiteboard? I can prank the whiteboard. I need the teacher to go out of here. Ray's already gone. Where are we going? Ray, where are you going? Okay. And as a drama llama, Ray wants to gossip five times, spread a rumor, mess around in the cuddle carts. Well, we need to work on our relationship with Molly. That's where that's going to happen. Um, Emmett's an ass because he's insulting us. Raja can't shake the feeling that others are just constantly judging him. Is it his hair? Personality? Friends? Whatever it is, Raja's afraid that it won't be the end of it. Oh, no. Fear of being judged. Oh, no. How do I get rid of this? Figure out differences of with other sims? Okay, today is the day. It's time to stare back into those judgy eyes and figure out exactly why they feel the need to judge you. Select two sims and click the figure out differences under the friendly category. Emmett, stand up. What? Wowee, that sim is irresistible. This is, that's, this is terrible. I got this. Wowee, that sim is irresistible. Raja has a major crush on Emery. But Emery's been a... A total D-bag. You're a teacher, though. Can I can I talk about differences with you? Maybe you'll be... Oh, I did it. I conquered my fear. Look at this. Fear conquered. Smooth talker. And Emery's my crush. So, I guess we gotta turn this around. How about we be funny? Joke about body hair, maybe? Let me add you on Social Bunny, dude. And we'll do it the back way. Huh? All right. Well, while Raja, I'm going to stack up a bunch of stuff for Raja so that we can become friends because that's our crush. Apparently he hates us. We got to find Molly. Are you going home, Molly? Molly. Oh, I just want to be friends with you. Okay. All right. Let's head home. Got things to do. My dad's. Uh, and Ray's already swimming in the pool. Who's this? Leaves? No leaves in my pool. So let's fill our needs and then we'll invite Emery over. Actually, maybe we take him to the pier. Ray, you want to go to the pier too? All right, I want to go to Plumby Pier. We're going to take Ray with us. All right, Raja. Let's invite... Let's invite Emery to the pier. Um, Raja. You didn't pay for that. Why are you making bubble tea by yourself? Okay, I did pay for it. That's good. That's good. I was like, geez, I'm just stealing now? Ray, could we have not been in our bathing suit? Fine, Molly will love it. I wanted to call Molly. We only know Molly. Oh, wow. I'm gonna take a quick nap while we wait for Emery to get here. Because he's hopefully coming. Um... I don't think Emery and Molly are coming. We got stood up. Uh, I'm sorry Emery didn't come. 
We'll see him tomorrow at school. Oh, no. As Raja stepped off the platform and into the carriage, he noticed a nearby attendant picked up a giant screw. As the wheel began to turn, he hears a quiet, uh-oh, come from the attendant. How does he react? Panic? Petrified? Or calm and composed? Um... Scream! When the attendant hears Raja scream, the worker calls out that he is safe and it is just a prank. The adjacent carrier... The adjacent... Carriages call out to try and comfort Raja as well. Plum Bite Pier echoes with cheers of comfort for the terrified Raja. Teamwork! The comforting voices snap Raja out of his stupor and he gains his composure. He exits the ride with shaky legs and an apology from a guilt ridden worker. He made it out there alive, he took a step towards conquering his ferris phobia. Jeez. Well, Apparently, I confronted another fear. Um, Ray's freezing to death, so how about you put some clothes on, Ray? Alright, well, it is now almost one in the morning. I need to get my Sims back home so they're nice and fresh for tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow our, our classmates are a little bit nicer. Um, what the hell? You guys! They were at our house the whole time! Let's try flirting with him. Since I have a competent mood lit, Raja has learned Emery's romantic orientation. I'm flattered, but I'm not interested in that type of relationship with you. But I would like to be friends. If you'd like to be friends, <gasps> rejection. Okay, that's okay, man. We can be friends. <sighs> All right, now I know. When you invite people over to the current lot you are at, it's your house. It feels like it's been forever since Vincent had been romantic with his partner. It could be paranoia. It could be anxiety. Or a gut feeling. But Vincent can't help but wonder what his partner's up to or who they've been seeing behind his back. No one! No one! He wants to talk over his relationship fears with Preston. Fear of being cheated on. Oh. Oh, that's terrible. Talk about our relationship fears. Need to address this. We need to talk about our relationship. Are you cheating on me? Oh, okay. You're not? Thank you. Uh, school starts an hour, Ray. Uh, just gonna tell you. Beds are for closers. We had a rough night. Check on Raja. <laughs> he didn't make it in the house either. <gasps> He's on the front porch. Oh. All right. Let's go to school. Are these all new students? <laughs> um, where's like Molly and Charity in the school? Oh, okay. Uh, I know we like Emery, but um, I guess you can talk to him. Just talk to him, fulfill your needs, and ask about mess around interests. Okay, Molly's single. He's single. That's good. That's good for us. Ray has learned Molly's romantic orientation. She's attracted to women. We're gonna slip right in there. And her mess around interests. Is that here? She likes to romance with women and she likes to mess around with women. Right, let's just keep flirting with her. Is an exam session after school today? Oh, come on! All right, well, go to class. All right, so we might have a prom date in the making here. It is Wednesday. I'm running out of time. And I think I want to take Emery, because our he's not hating me as much. Maybe we can have Raja take Emery as a friend? That might be nice. All right, we're going to do some of Raja's live fast aspirations. Whoa! Whoa! What's going on? The fire drill? Okay, might be time where we prank the board. I'm gonna prank the whiteboard. <laughs> there you go. Made a nice little poopy on the board. All right, let's plank. Hit you with the buzzer. Does that count? Ooh, that counts. Oh, let's do it to the teacher. All right, let me get you with the hand buzzer. 
No, no, no. Get here with the hand buzzer. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, she doesn't see us. She doesn't see us. Don't, don't turn around. Go back to your go back to your desk. Yeah. Do the other students hear it? <laughs> they don't care. <laughs> I'm not done hacking it. Let's go. Hurry up. Hurry up. Yeah. There you go. We might have to get in trouble tomorrow. Oh, Molly's down here. Quick, let's do sexy poses. <laughs> Oh, she likes it. Oh, that's where it starts. Little attraction. Where are we going? I'm going to declare my love publicly. Please don't reject me. All right, Molly. Wowee, that sim is irresistible. Ray has a major crush on Molly. Ask about love life. Oh, we're just getting wants. Raja wants to plant a stink capsule in a locker. He wants to sneak out. So let's do that, and then we'll head home. <laughs> ah. It's just right. All right, stick it in their locker. There you go. He wants to eat food. I mean, don't we all? I'm going to leave this episode right here. Raja had a major crush on Emery, and he got rejected. Emery doesn't like men, but that's okay. So he got over it and decided to begin his life of mischief. Classes are not our main focus. It's Molly. We need a date to prom and a girlfriend. We are feeling some of our aspirations as Drama Llama, but that's not our main focus. Molly wants us and we want her. So if you like today's video, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. Because I'm putting out more high school years content and you don't want to miss out on all this drama. With that being said, I'll catch you in the next one. See ya. If you're enjoying the Let's Play of the High School Year Pack, why don't you check out the review I did over here? It gives my opinions and reviews of, is this pack really worth $40?